The G43 is the semi-automatic rifle that the German assault kit comes equipped with by default, and I know that most, if not all players, would prefer to use this rifle instead of the Car 98K. So today I will show you how to use this rifle and hit your targets at 100 meters and up to 300 meters. So if you like the sound of that, give this video a like and subscribe for more. So 100 meters takes one bullet to kill your target. When going for a headshot, just get their head at the tip of your sight. When hitting a moving target, just aim slightly ahead of them. And for a sprinting target, again, aim ahead as shown in the highlighted circles. Now at 150 meters, it takes two shots to kill your target. For a headshot, just get their head at the tip of your sight. For a moving target, the aiming point is pretty much exactly the same as it is for 100 meters. But just now it takes two shots now. For sprinting targets, you need to get your target towards the edge of the inner part of your sight. Just note, it's two shots. At 200 meters, again it takes two shots to down your target. At 200 meters for a headshot, we're looking at aiming just below the tip of the sight. At 200 meters, aim so your target is towards the edge of the inner part of your sight. Just remember to account for distance at this range. And for sprinting targets, it's getting tricky now. You gotta get your target right at the edge of your sight. 250 meters for a kill is two shots. And for a headshot, aim further down your sight and the point is pretty much in line with the dark part of the sight. A move-in target at 250 is right towards the edge of the sight. And the aim point for sprinting targets is pretty much the same as 200 meters. Now 300 meters for a kill, it's two shots. And 300 meters for a headshot is just below the dark part of the site. So just a little bit lower than 250. And the aim point for a moving target is nearly the same as 250 sprinting, but just slightly towards the inner part of the site. And a sprinting target at this range is just going to be difficult, but this is where you aim. So I hope you liked this video and I really hope that it helps you out when using this rifle. It is a damn good rifle and it's, it's kind of a bit sucky that more roles don't get to use this rifle for the German side, but uh, we never know what will happen as the game progresses through its development cycle. So if this video has helped you out, give it a like, subscribe for more, and check out my other videos I've made on the guns. Got one up for the Kana EA and the M1 brand, and more will be coming in the future. So thank you for watching.